What's up, Pokemon fans? Mega Teddy Ursa here, and today we have another Pokemon Origin video. If you believe in wishing upon a star, then maybe this video will be perfect for you. Today, we are covering the origin of Jirachi, a Pokemon who can grant anything a person may desire. Sounds pretty dope, right? Well, without further ado, let's get into it. Have you ever gazed into the stars? I for sure have. If you haven't noticed yet, I always use space in my videos. It's impossible to understand the universe and how it was created. Whatever sparked creation also sparked the creation of life. But did that spark create life all over the universe? Well, in my last video, I proved how Deoxys was an extraterrestrial life form. But what you may not know is that Deoxys is only one of many alien Pokemon. The Millennium Comet, a part of space that can be seen from the Pokemon world. It shines greatly through the atmosphere. To many, this visual is a myth, but to those who have seen it, they have been truly blessed. It only appears one week every thousand years. Its occurrence is welcomed with a variety of great festivals. But what is so special about this place in the universe? The Millennium Comet is a group of comets that orbit the Earth very slowly. There is a sense of happiness and a greater power surrounding these comets. The clashing meteorites seem to have a magical power. One piece of the comet is actually on its way to breaking the Earth's atmosphere as we speak. Could this be an issue for the Pokemon world? Let's check it out! This remote forest is about to become a mythical place. As the meteorite plunges into the Earth's surface, it plants itself undisturbed. For hundreds of years, this meteorite wreckage stayed untouched and unmoved, until the Millennium Comet was in the sky once more. Then and there, a new Pokemon was born. This Pokemon was Jirachi. Jirachi, otherwise known as the Wishmaker Pokemon, only comes to life one week every thousand years the entire length of the Millennium Comet. In this time period, Jirachi will have the power to grant three wishes. In order for a wish to come true, one must write the wish on one of three banners on Jirachi's head. When the Jirachi wakes up, the trainer's wishes will be granted. The slit on Jirachi's stomach is actually its true eye. When a wish is granted, Jirachi will open this third eye and the wish will be put into action. The first trainer to prove this occurrence was the trainer Gemma, a young girl who found Jirachi and was granted three wishes. This was only one of many instances in the Pokemon world. One instance where Professor Oak was involved in an effort to save five of his Pokedex holders, but we'll save that for another video. In the movie Jirachi Wishmaker, once again, our boy Ash was lucky enough to be in the presence of this Pokemon. You guys may also remember May's brother Max. He was the trainer Jirachi chose to befriend, but ran into some troubles in the meantime. Jirachi had to defeat false Groudon, and Jirachi did manage to destroy the fake Groudon with Doom Desire. It then went back to sleep because of Max's sadness. That's one of those things nobody will ever get over, right? I mean, he pretty much caught the Jirachi, and then it goes back to sleep. Whatever I guess, you gotta keep going. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you heard a little bit of a, like an audio, like vocal problem, uh, I'm working on fixing that. I still don't have my setup since the move yet, so once that gets 100% completed, that sound will be gone. If you guys did not see the Pokemon Let's Play Light Platinum with me, and Weaves and Rings, I suggest you check it out now because Weaves and Rings was in the process of creating a new plush toy and actually it is going to be in a giveaway that I am hosting so you guys can learn a bit about that and she's making it as that video is going on so I will put the link right up here in the top left. Like always Pokemon fans, take it easy, peace out.